Hello everyone. I hope you are doing fine. So today we will look for the NJDCAD. So NJDCAD is moving in the descending channel and making a bullish flag pattern and has been rejected at uh, the third point of the tra resistance trend line. So let me show you. So in the previous uh, what we will see here, the market is moving from a uh, market was in uptrend and the market is making the higher lower low and lower high lower low lower high lower low so for the perfect uh, resistance and we will make it the line chart then we can make a perfect then we can make a perfect resistance trend line and another trend line is that we can make a perfect demand trend line and now if we may now we can make a candlestick chart so now what we will see here so uh, for the bullish flag pattern what we see uh, if the market is coming from the uh, uptrend uh, market is coming from the uptrend then market breaks the uh, this uh, channel and move again towards to uptrend now so now what we are seeing here the market is making the same pattern and making a bullish flag pattern so now what we will do here we will uh, mark the uh, some bullish order block uh, where it is forming if we move into the day chart for the njd cad now we have to look for the resistance level that means our supply zone so where are the supply zones uh, in order to uh, move in a uh, continue the uptrend we have to see the lower high of the channel for the descending uh, that is the market zone in the descending channel so we will firstly mark the lower high point so these all are the lower high area point and this and one is this one another one is this one so these all are the lower high point area and the previous resistance for the uh, njd cad is so if we make it in the order block form then we can have a great move if the market continues the uptrend and now slightly the market is running in a uptrend now so our order block for the bullish order block is the point this one is the bullish order block and market has already uh, tossed the bullish order block and has been rejected and continuing the uptrend now so if we move in again into the 4 hour time frame so what we see here in a 4 hour time frame the market has break the trend line that means which trend line uh, let me show you the market has break the trend line so what we see here the in the previous time the market has made a double top this one is the double top and the neckline was this was the neckline and if we make it in an order block form it will be better for us so now let us draw order block now if the order block got break uh, into the upside then we can move into the buy position if the order block got rejected then we can enter into the sell positions or wait for the uh, this order block to again get rejected then we can move into the buy position from here again and if the order got uh, rejected from this trend line, we can move into the sale for the short period of time in a 4 hour and also the for the uh, long trade we can make a tp1 tp2 tp3 into the downside if it got rejected so we have to wait for the candle and the previous support for this trade is for this njd cad is this one is the order block and another swing low point is the this one is the swing low point it means we have the take profit zones almost uh, more than 100 pips so market is rejecting the trend line one time two time and three time already and it is the fourth time trying the market to break the trend line into the upside direction and we are waiting for the candle to close below the order block then we can enter into a sell position so this is not for the confirmation now and we are looking for the bullish uh, trend uh, as the market is the making the 
bullish flag pattern so this is the bullish flag pattern and market has break uh, one times two times but these all are the fake breakout and from here we have to got double top and this one is the good for the sale so until we get a from until we get a proper confirmation uh, to move the nzdc in the uptrend we will wait for the market uh, either it uh, when it when it got rejected from the bullish uh, order block these all are the order blocks and these all are the demand zone for the nzdc ad so is, uh, for now the market is trying to break the uh, trend line into the upside direction or if it got rejected then you can move into the sell position for a short period we taking the stop loss up to 10 to 20 pips only not more than that we can we will not make risk and more than that also if we see here how is the market performing so let me show in only these areas the market is making the opposite symmetrical triangle so this one is the opposite symmetrical triangle for the market oh, this is how uh, we done this is how the market is running in the this and that triangle form in a triangle if the market got rejected again one it is making the double top for the uh, market so if we see here so this one is the one uh, point and another point is uh, if the candle got rejected then we can get a, again we can get again a double top to move the continue to move in the downtrend so until we get a confirmation either into the buy direction or, or into the sell position we will wait for the confirmation we will not enter into the position i in the both side we will wait for the market uh, i hope you guys have understand and where will be the out take profit zones i have already told that is all the lower highs are the tp1 tp2 tp3 and this is with the swing tp for us uh, if we make a position trades uh, and for the swing for the swing trade this all the lower highs are the tps and for the swing trade uh, this previous resistance and that means the supply zone will be the our the take profit uh, moving uh, if we the market continue in the uptrend we can set break even and continue and hold the trade until our swing tp so this is how we enter uh, thank you guys